If you're driving to Buffalo for the game, know that you may run into some nasty weather. And I'm calling up the National Guard. I'll be declaring a state of emergency for Western New York because we are expecting uh, very serious whiteout, blizzard-like conditions. That's New York Governor Kathy Hochul. She's calling for a ban on tan tandem trucks and empty tractor trailers on all state roads beginning tomorrow morning at 9 from the Rochester area to the Pennsylvania line. And she says depending on how things develop, there may be additional restrictions. Let's check back in with Ray for a look at how things are shaping up in Buffalo for the weekend. Ray. Yeah, and the winds are the big thing we're looking at because the winds are what dictate where and how much the snow is going to be. And right now we're anticipating the yellow set of errors to push the snow up into Orchard Park, New York, near Buffalo. That's where the stadium is located. But any little shift would determine or would push that snow into a different direction. So what we're looking at snowfall wise is a trip along I-90 to be quite treacherous. I think by Saturday evening we could have one to three inches there with some gusty winds that could be gusting to the tune of 65 miles per hour. I know that doesn't sound like a lot, but watch what happens Saturday night into Sunday. Look how this snow starts to, to tick upward and even into Sunday afternoon. And we're going to be looking by the time the game is over at potentially around a foot of snow near Orchard Park. There there is more snow that's expected even into Sunday night and early Monday. So traveling up that way could become quite difficult.